Hello and welcome back in Alderburg. We still have a lot to do. We only have one quest to drag down those bandits, but I still would like to see some more people in my army. I guess I will ask uh, people around here in the Papal state to join me because they seem to have some good recruits. And I will also run around do some quests for the village elders and maybe I could find some other interesting fights because I really need some experience. But since the last episode we actually have a very nice looking armor so I like that quite a bit. I still have, ooh, I still have some levels to spend. Okay, I will do that uh, but not now. Let me spend those levels and look for something interesting. And on my travels, I got back to Dürrhim, because there is a tournament here. Dürrhim is somewhat close, so this is why I will join the tournament, I will fight in the tournament, and hopefully I could make some money here, because it seems like I'm running out of money slowly but surely. I only have around... I don't know, I think 6,000 6, florins left, and that is not a whole lot. So let me try to see what I could do in that tournament. You know, while I'm fighting here, I'm wondering if actually anything happens if your companions win that tournament. I'm not so sure because companions are here, some of my companions are participating here. I don't know if there's actually anything happening if they win. Could be interesting to know, but I guess none of them will win because I'm going to win. So currently we are in the final round of the tournament. Not such a great tournament. We did kill some people, but not the best tournament I've ever had. But I should be able to win it and to get some, some more money, I guess. I should be able to do it, hopefully. Because what I really need right now is money. For some reason I'm running short of uh, on money. Because maybe I bought so many mercenaries in the last episode. But I guess, hopefully, nope, this is where I die. If I lose my mount, I cannot kill anyone with my lance, so the only thing I can hope for is to maybe get to safety like that, maybe be able to pick up that mount, and now I'm dead. The only thing I can hope for is now to find another replacement. Why can I not jump over that? Yep, I'm going to die here. I'm going to die. Maybe he's going to die. Yes, at least he died. Well, as I said, not the best tournament I fought, but at least we gained some money, I think. Let me take a look at the results. Yes, we won again, Tobacco again, a thousand experience and 5,500 of Florence. That's fine. Let me instantly sell that Tobacco, because I don't really need that. Okay, what about the arms merchant? But I, I think I do have some nice weapons. Yeah, to be honest, I'm, I'm kind of happy with that. Gloinia, 28,000 unbalanced, requires 30 strength. Well, use this to fire cannons. I think I saw cannons in one match before, but I don't know if I'm ever able to use those things. Okay, let me take a look around uh, some more, do some quests, get some new units and maybe find some lord battles. This must be your unlucky day, mate. We're just about the worst people you could run into in these parts. <laughs> For me, you're nothing that the walking mon money bags. Well, I found the deserters. The problem is they could be hard again. Maybe I do have to do that on my own. Let me see. They're probably charging it as yes, they are. But it seems like we, we do not have any... Are those cavalrists? I'm not so sure. Just stay here and maybe you could shoot some of them. Do I even have anyone with ranged weapons? I'm not so sure about that. Okay, seems like those guys are not any... That is actually very good. But those guys look kind of tough. Ooh, who the heck is that? On the mount there. Nope, I missed. Yeah, figures. Would have, that would be too cool if I could have killed that guy. But I guess maybe I shouldn't let my guys run into the, those guys. Ouch. 21 damage. Because I guess at least they look tough. Who are those guys? Elite Spearmen. Yeah, I guess I should just try to circle around those guys and hopefully be able to kill them. Because if I send all of my units in, they're probably going to die, I guess. But now, yeah, now they're charging in anyway. Okay, now my team is going to die, I guess. 
What? Yes, very good. At least the ex at least that guy died. And now all of my uh, army is probably going to die here. But it's worth the effort, I guess. Because I really want to uh, be done with that quest as soon as possible. Even if I lose like half of my army again, that's fine. I just want to be able to finish that quest. Because those deserters quests usually give a lot of experience. And we got them. Very, very, very nice. I like it. Battle 1, press tap to leave. Anything else? Two enemy prisoners. Yeah, I guess you could release them. That's fine. Farmers and peasant women. No, I'm not going to take those guys with me. No, thank you. And a 34 battered heraldic armor. I will give that to some of my companions. That is very nice. And now I guess it is time to look for something else to do. Swordsman and cavalry. Let me see. Swordsman and cavalry. Yeah, I guess it doesn't hurt to have some cavalry. Okay, at least that quest is done. I also accepted a quest to capture a lord from the Rodox while I was traveling around. I'm not so sure if I'm able to do that. I mean, obviously I will try to look around for some lord battles. Maybe I could find some. Let me see what else I could find. But first, it is time to turn the quest in. Can we maybe get some levels? You have advanced to level 16 and Kini... Kinius has advanced to level 8. Very nice, and a thousand florins. Maybe another quest? Seems like I cannot accept another quest. Okay, never mind. Let me look for some lords. Hopefully I could find a lord, because that quest is probably going to give a lot of experience as well. I couldn't really find a lord battle yet, but I got the quest to hunt down troublesome bandits. And those bandits, and even someone joined me, those bandits are not too tough, because I can remember killing a lot of those guys on my own. I think back then it were looters, but I'm pretty sure those bandits are not a problem. But that quest should give me something nice as well. Let me quickly get rid of those guys. Yeah, especially together with the lord party from the... Pope, that is obviously not a problem, that fight. There is one remaining enemy, hopefully he's going to die, if not... Okay, never mind. I actually hoped maybe he would survive because I really wanted to shoot that guy with my nice musket here. Okay, never mind. At least the quest is done. I should have finished the quest. No, yeah, very nice. Let me turn in that quest right away. That's probably going to give something good. Hunt down troublesome bandits. Come on, give me something nice for that. Um, well, <laughs> to renown 240 experience. Okay, nothing, nothing to you, you know, nothing. Um, arrival hand in a group of bandits, kidnaps a daughter. I already know that quest. Um, yes, I could, uh, I could bring back the girl because in that quest you could actually. Well, we'll see it as soon as we get there. Let me just quickly walk there. Where do I have to go? I have to go to Glunmar. So, let me go to Glunmar. And here we have the bandits awaiting ransom. You could just pay them, or you could just try to kill everyone and get the girl like that. Let me take a look. No, those guys are cavalrists. I can already see that they are sitting on a horse. So, you know what? I will just give them the money. It's only 420 florins anyway. So they can just get the money, I will take the girl with me, you come with me, we're going home. So I will now go back, turn the quest in and hopefully get a nice little reward for that. What is that? The Telos army running from me. Only 14 units, you know what, we're going to try to kill that guy. Is he faster than me? No, I am faster than him. Come on, come on, let me get that guy. Oh, that could be interesting. I am Craftsman Marie d'Artois. Mark it down. Surrender or die, you heap of filth. That is doable. That is probably doable. That is the first Lord battle that I'm going to do here without any help. Let me see, are they charging at us? I don't think so. Okay, it could take a while for the battle to start here, but... Hopefully I'm able to do that. That would be the first Lord battle that I'm going to win on my own. And it seems like they're charging at us, maybe. The problem is just that is a very, very, very bad terrain for my lance. I'm not sure if I'm actually going to be able to kill anyone with my lance here. Maybe I could take, off, take care of that guy? How could I have missed that? Okay, everyone attack that guy. Come on, everyone charge. Kill him before he kills too many of my units. Yeah, very good. And now we will wait for the remaining enemies to get here. Very good. That should give me enough time to... 
reload my weapon. Everyone come a little bit back. I want the crossbowman to have a very good position here. What? And that interrupted the reloading. Okay, never mind. I think we should be able to do that. I think we should be able. The problem is just those guys are probably quite tough. Come on, I do have some mercenary crossbowmen. They should be able to kill some people. Come on, come on, you can do it, guys. Stop reloading! <laughs> it takes so freaking long. Everyone just charge in. Maybe I could try to kill someone with my land. Oh god! Why is everyone shooting at me? Go away, elite spearman. Wow, those guys are probably going to kill us. Yes, very good, another one dead. Very good, another one. Come on, we're actually winning this. This is the first. Oh, the kidnapped girl. Can the kidnapped girl actually die? Who? she survived. Whew. Okay, this is the first Lord battle I fought without any help. Can you see that bolt right in? Oh, th does that hurt, Marie de Troyes? Does that hurt? Hopefully not. Okay, we did it. Can I? He escaped. That's too bad. That is too bad. And only some... <laughs> only very shitty loot. Okay, that's not a problem. He escaped. That's sad. Kidnapped girl has advanced to level 3. <laughs> okay. Because I still have the quest to capture a, a lord from Rodok. Okay, never mind. I will go back, turn the quest in now, and maybe I do find some other battles. Uh, okay, made peace. Maybe I do find some other battles while I'm on my way. And we are back. Kidnapped girl left the party. Thank you so much for bringing me back. Let me see. Um, where is Marketplace Guildhall? Ooh, we, we, we do look kind of good, I think. Oh, wait, I could sit down. I can actually sit down. Wait. Yes, I can. Okay, very nice. Um, could I, could I stand up again? <laughs> could, could I, could I stand up again? I'm pressing everything, but it seems like I cannot stand up anymore. <laughs> okay, well, it seems like that could be a nice feature, but uh, for some reason I cannot... Okay, I guess I have to go out again and go back to the guild hall. Okay, never mind. Let's just pretend that never happened. Um, very nice. 300 experience, 100 florins. Well, it's okay, but it's not awesome. Maybe another quest. Uh, send a trade good convoy. No, I'm not going to do that anymore. The last convoy sent me, like... Like to the other end of the of the world. I'm not going to do that anymore. Okay, anything I could sell, yeah, I could get rid of that. I still have to find an enemy lord. Maybe I could do it. Let me take a look around. And just in case you're wondering, yes, I am working every day on my masterpiece. Hello, Master Brewer. I mean, I could try it already. I think I should have a 15% chance, something like that, to create that masterpiece. But for the time being, I'd rather not. I think I will just run around and look for some more battles, because I still need an army. And before I go, I thought, you know what, I could quickly check the tavern. But can you see that guy? He's going to attack me, and if you see my health bar, I'm very close to dying. But I should be able to do it. I think I will try to shoot him immediately. How did that miss? <laughs> okay, he's probably going to kill me now. Probably, let's see. Maybe if he just stands there, I could try to... No, he's coming. Because if he would just stay there, I could reload my weapon. Oh, never mind, I, I still did it. Pooh, such a waste. Such a waste. That was actually close. Uh, but how did that miss? Okay, never mind. And what do we have here? We have a castle under attack. I just passed by and thought, you know what, I could join it. The battle is almost over anyway. I will join it because that should give me some nice experience. Not experience, but some relation with the lords who are participating here. The problem is just that I don't have a shield equipped. I don't know why I forgot about that, but running around in a siege without a shield is it's not suicide but it's it's bad because there are so many arches on the walls and obviously if they hit me once i will die instantly the only hope i have is that maybe i could shoot someone with my firearm here that could give me some experience so i will try to climb that ladder as well but it seems like i cannot do it no there, there's just too much going on maybe i could nope that's what i thought 
Okay, seems like all of my people are going to get slaughtered up there, but still we should be able to do it. I will reload and hope that I could maybe shoot someone else. Probably not, but you never know. There should be hopefully someone on the walls. Seems like we already made it on the walls and now people are dying very, very fast. So obviously we're going to win that. I just hope maybe I could shoot someone myself, but as you can see, not going to work. Only 10, 9, 8. Yeah, I could try to climb the ladder, but I won't make it in time anyway. So I guess I can just wait and hope that I'm not getting any casualties. Already one of my my team died, but that's fine. That's still acceptable. Okay, maybe, maybe I could, because some of them are spread out a bit. Maybe I could try to charge someone myself, because at least with a firearm I have one guaranteed kill, if I could hit that guy. Oh god, he's far away. But as you can see right there, some of my units could get stuck somewhere, and that could be a good opportunity to kill someone myself. Um, seems like only one enemy is remaining. I can see him up there. He will probably, yeah, he's dead. Okay, never mind. Killed by Swadian Crossbowman. Very good job, everyone. I mean, we didn't do much, but at least, hey, that's the first siege we've been in. Very, very nice. Uh, do I even get something? No, <laughs> I didn't even get any relation. I get, I got nothing. Well, I guess I will ask for some quests here, but I really want to be able to finish that quest. I really need to capture one of those lords. So let me try to take a look around here. And this is probably a bad idea. I just asked for some quests and as you can see he wants me to free someone from prison. I know that this is a very hard quest and I think with all my renown I'm not even able to sneak into those um, into those thieves because he's probably Yalkil is probably a town and I'm I don't think I'm able to sneak into that thing. I mean, I could accept the quest, but I'm pretty sure I'm not able to do it. I I can try to do that, but that's probably bad. I'm thinking breaking him, finding and fighting my way out, taking the taking Yal kill by storm. I've done enough planning time to act. Yep. Well, I tried. I went to Yal kill and seems like I am able to fool the guards and get inside the town, but. I'm still not sure. Let's go to the suburbs, I guess. I do have I do have to take a look around for the prison. The prison may be that thing. I'm not so sure. I have to take a look around. But that quest is probably my death. I'm not so sure yet. Because I do have to fight some of these guys. And what are those guys doing? Are you, sh are you sure that you're not drowning? What is the prison guard doing here? Armorer, weaponsmith. I wish to buy a new weapon. Well, it's interesting that you will uh, sell me weapons while you're uh, drowning, but I guess that's fine. The question is just, I cannot really attack that guy because with my shitty pole arm, I won't even be able to take any da to deal any damage. You need to get permission. You know what? I I, I will try that. Um. All right, I'll leave now. Uh, you got that right. Still into prison. Give me this. Give me the keys now. Can I even attack that guy? Wait. Did I not did I not attack him? Give me the keys now. Get off bec before I cut your throat. Wait, he is here, right? I want to speak. Let me let me go in. Wait. I, wait, quest succeeded? I already succeeded the quest? Hmm. I'm a bit confused because usually you have to attack these prison guards. And that was actually very stupid what I just did, because if that guy killed me, I would have lost my whole army, I think. But usually, you have to kill that guy, get the keys to the cell and free whoever's in there. But maybe they modified that in, in, in this mod. Probably. Okay, I guess we're done here. So I will go back, try to find the Lord, and hopefully I will not get caught on my way back. Because that quest could actually... This quest has been succeeded. Okay. This quest could give me a lot of HP. Let me try to go back, find the Lord and turn the quest in. And a few in-game days later I found him. Gui Martus. The interesting thing is just... 
I mean, I did complete the quest, I will obviously turn it in. He's following someone, but I, I, did, I didn't get a notification that there is a campaign going on. So maybe I could just follow those guys and see, and see what they're up to. Um, very nice. You saved him. Thank you so much. 1,500 fronts, 2,000 experience. Very, very good. That was probably that was very good. No, should, no, no, no. He wants to train. Uh, he he wants me to train some units. I'm not going to do that. Okay, very very nice. I still have to capture Lord. Maybe I could try to initiate a fight here by luring those guys into each other. That could be hard, but I will try my best. I still want a gathering and feast in Praven. That's interesting as well. And all of a sudden, rumor traveling a tournament in the town of Hai Kadi Uk. Oh, so, oh, a lot is happening. Wait, Nordic Union Kingdom of Swedia, that is my empire. Okay, so a lot of things happened in just a few seconds. Seems like we are now at war with the Nordic Union as well. There is a quest in Hat in Dul Kuba. That is too far away. I'm not going to travel that far. And there is a feast in Praven, and usually feasts also mean that there is a tournament as well. So, I guess I will attend a tournament, or maybe I could find some lord battles. Let's see. And while walking around, I found another lord. I think I should be faster, because I really want to complete that quest. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Duca Delicant, who are you? Who would come in arms to dispute our righteous cause? Marie de Troyes. You may have bested Conte de Talosh, but you cannot defeat us all. Well, I'm going to try that. Only 14 enemies. Hopefully I'm able to do that again. Let me see. Are, are they charging? It seems like they're charging. Okay, everyone just stay right here. And hopefully I could kill that guy before he makes it here. Is he charging? Yeah, I think he is. Okay, let him come. Yes, very good shot, mercenary crossbowman. Very good shot. The next Lord battle we're going to win. But still, you know what? I could invest a little bit in prisoner management because prisoner management increases your chance, I think, to capture enemy lords. So this is why I will actually uh, put something in uh, prisoner management. Hopefully we could kill these guys before they make it here. Yes, yeah, Swady and Sharpshooter. Yeah, I did upgrade some units from time to time, and we now have a Swadian sharpshooter, and that guy seems to be good. Come on. Come on, you can do it again. Maybe I should charge in and don't let them just run at us. I should kill some of those guys like that, for example. And now, oh god, please don't kill me. Boom, and I missed again. Yeah, for some reason it seems like I don't really have much luck killing those guys with my firearm. Maybe I really need a pistol or something, something else. Because it takes years to reload that thing. And that is actually a very big disadvantage. Okay, everyone can just charge in. It seems like we're, we're not doing such a bad job. So we are actually already able to defeat some lord parties. I mean, obviously, those lords don't have very good units because probably no one advanced yet in the technology uh, system, I guess. But we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. The only worry I have is that we are now at war with the Nordic Union as well, and that could be hard. Uh, but he escaped as well. Seems like I'm out of luck. Seems like I'm out of luck. I will still try my best, but... Seems like I'm out of luck. There are more lords to fight. Let me take another look around. Do I have any quests? Yeah, I still need to attend that. Forget it. I'm not going to run that far. I only have to capture a lord. Let me see what I can do. You know what I could do as well? I just thought maybe I could become a vassal of Swadia. Because, I mean, the mercenary contract is probably giving me more money, but maybe being a vassal will increase my prestige and let me, you know, climb the ladder of the social ranks. So let me see what he has to say. My lady, you seem to have the makings of a good war leader. For a woman to sow such skills is an uncommon thing in Calradia, but not completely without precedent. Now the women have often taken commands of armies, husbands were captured for example. However, I have never heard of a king who granted a fief to a woman, no matter how valorous. Yeah, that's what I thought. Simply because he needed an extra vessel. Were I to do such a thing, I would raise eyebrows across Calradia. Men would say that I was bestowed a bewitched. Uh, yeah, that's what I thought. 
So it seems like they don't really want to see female leaders here. Um, as much as I regret it, I cannot afford to grant you a thief. Hmm. If I were to, uh, to take one of the enemy's castles by force, marry one of your lords, perhaps one of your competitors will prove to be more open-minded. Well, maybe that could persuade him to accept me, but I could be willing to fight for you even without a thief. No, never mind then. Okay, seems like I'm not going to become a vassal. Maybe I could try to become a vassal of the of the Pope of the Papal state. Because they actually seem like nice guys as well, I guess. Or maybe I should just wait. Because the mercenary payment for the time being is actually not that bad. Okay, what else could I do? Because uh, I wanted, since I couldn't find any lords uh, from a Rodok to to fight and to capture. Um, there is one, but he's obviously going to kill me with 119 units, but I'm faster than him, so that's no problem. I thought maybe I could take a look at these abandoned mines, and I think this, this is what I'm going to do. Let me just quickly see and hope that no bandits are going to attack me, because I really want to see what that is. Here we are, the abandoned mines. What is that? A mine is catching your eyes. You notice it's a perfect place to carry stones and search for gemstones. The mine appears to be abandoned. Rusty pickaxes and splintered shafts mark the place of a long vacated site. That could be a place where I could actually mine for ores. You can repair the mine and bring back the activity that once was the keystone of prosperity in the nearby villages. Note that... Wait, 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 what? Note that a mine is a very, very dangerous place to be. Sometimes it collapses. You know what? Repair it. 15,000 florins per week. Wait, what? Up on repairing the mine, you'll restore the mine shaft, support the walls and ceilings with large oak beams. This, however, is a costly operation which requires 50,000 florins. <laughs> Upon completion, though, you can grant our charters and people return a small week profit. The problem is just, I don't have enough money. I have 16,000. You know what, I'm going to do that. You do not have enough gold. It's sad I have 16,000. 16, Wait a second, carry stone. But now I can, now I can click carry stone. Maybe it is repaired now. I mean, it did say I don't know, I don't have enough gold, but I will check that out in just a second. You can carry stones and three types of ore in the mine. Make sure you have the mining pickaxe equipped. I don't have a mining pickaxe. Get into the mine and hit the stone ore several times to collect it. Okay, sounds simple enough. Ores exist of either iron, silver, and less occurring gold. You need to smelt ores by climbing the ladder of the furnace and interacting with the minecart. Have fun. My god, I'm going to have a lot of fun. Do I have a do I have a pickaxe? No. Where do I get a pickaxe now? Maybe there's a pickaxe lying around here somewhere. Because I'm not going to be able to to uh, mine anything with my lands here. I could actually drop that. Okay, the furnace is right here. That is good to know. Wow, that is that is a cool feature. Mining and oh, here I have to climb that and probably throw the ores in there. But still, where do I get a pickaxe? Maybe inside the mine. Um, let me take a look around, but I'm pretty sure I have to probably go inside the mine. I mean, the, the arrow is telling me where I have to go, but I don't have a pickaxe yet. So maybe a pickaxe is lying around here somewhere, hopefully. God, hopefully that thing doesn't collapse. W wait, how much money do I have? I still have 16,000 florins. Seems like the, the mine is repaired, but... I didn't, I didn't actually pay anything for that. The problem is just, I do have some doors here. The problem is still I don't have a, I don't have a pickaxe. I already dropped that, right? I don't have a pickaxe. Let me look around for a pickaxe. Well guys, maybe I'm blind, but I cannot find a pickaxe anywhere. Maybe I do have to buy one in the nearby villages. But that wouldn't make any sense. I, I'm pretty sure there should be a pickaxe around here somewhere. But as I said, I, I, I've looked everywhere now and I couldn't find a pickaxe. So I guess, wait, what is that? 
Is that another entrance? Wait, what the heck is that? Is that a portal to a second dimension? No, it's not. Race ladder? What the heck is that? I have no idea what I'm doing right now. Because I'm still actually looking for a pickaxe. But let me see what that is going to do for me. Race ladder. I guess there is a ladder now here somewhere. Okay, what did that do? That actually didn't do a damn thing. Yeah, I am a bit confused because I still, <laughs> I still don't have a pickaxe. Do I have one in my inventory? No. I guess I will just uh, try to find one. You know what? I'm going back to... I'm going outside again. Return. I will try to find a pickaxe maybe in that town here. Let me see. Ray Vadin. Hello, Ray Vadin. Let me check the marketplace and I guess arms? Mm, I don't see a pick... Oh, mining pickaxe! This is what I'm talking about. Okay, let me quickly sell some of the stuff I don't need. <coughs> Very good, I still have enough money. Very good, I don't need that short sword as well. Very nice. So, now let's go back to the mine. And say hello to the mine. It seems like now we're finally ready to mine some ores, hopefully. Smelt them. God, I cannot wait. Come on, let me see. I want to find gold right away. Okay, destructible target right in front of me. Does that mean I can destroy? Yes. Come on. Do I hit them? Yes, I do. Okay, that is the right angle. Very nice. Hopefully, the, the thing doesn't collapse. But why would it collapse if I'm hitting the stones on the ground? Three prestige points earned and I got a stone. Okay, what is... I mean, there's gold lying around right there. Can you not take that? I guess not. Ooh, there's something here as well. Yeah, let me mine that. I, I think I do need to find the right angle. It seems like that could be the right... I'm not so sure yet. Your mining pickaxe has broken. Lost item mining pickaxe. What? <laughs> Okay, so I guess I do have to go back to the town and buy some new mining pickaxes. But wow, that thing broke fast. Uh, let me see. Arms merchant. He had another one, right? Yeah, he, he has another one. But wow, if that... Hmm. That could be bad if the pickaxes break that fast. Well, you know what? Let me go back to the mine. And we're back in the mines. And it seems like everything resets whenever I leave the mine. So I guess I can just hope that this time my mining pickaxe is not going to break that fast. Um, am I am I hitting that thing? I'm not so sure. Yeah, now yeah, now we're making progress. Okay, is that just going to give me stone again? Maybe I really have to look for some just stones again. Okay, I guess maybe I really have to look for any veins like ore and silver veins in the in the walls. But it seems like I can just hit stones around here uh, everywhere. So I guess I will just continue to hit that uh, stone in the middle of the area. What is that? God, that is a large area. But that's uh, that looks interesting. Is that something I could mine? No, these are just some stones, I guess. Okay, just figuring out stuff. But I think I will go back to the main room and try to... Maybe get some ores there. And it's almost gone. One and... I think now... Got three prestige and again just a stone. I guess I will not try to get anything right there. Maybe I'm really supposed to hit those little things on the walls. Okay, let me try that stone. And the stone should be gone now. And again, just a stone. Well... I can just hope to get something interesting here. Maybe right now? Uh, nope. Again, nothing. Maybe here. And one more time. And... And another stone. Wow, we have a lot of stones already. But I don't want stones. I want ores. Give me silver. Give me gold. Give me iron. Give me anything else but stones. And another stone. God, we are blessed. And come on. And one more time. And one more time. And another stone. God, I could... I, I will sell all these stones and I'm... I'm gonna... I'm going to be rich. 
with all these stones. Maybe I'm actually <laughs> maybe I'm actually doing something wrong here. Maybe there are, there are other uh, things I could destroy. But I'm pretty sure these are the only things. Let me take an extensive look around. And even after quite some time of looking around, I couldn't find anything too interesting. So I guess I'm really supposed to destroy these things until I get something of value. So I will just do that. But my pickaxe at least lasts a bit longer than the first one. So that is nice. Just once and come on, you have to work. And I... Ooh, take a look what we have here. The question is just, will that thing be on the same position when I enter again? Boom, gold ore. Okay, so now I know what I'm looking for. And is that actually... I think that is a silver vein, maybe. Let me see. Is that a silver vein? It is an iron. Okay, is, th is that iron as well right here? It looks almost the same, but it seems like that's no iron. So I guess we're making progress here. Maybe I could find something else before my pickaxe breaks. And then it's time to go to the furnace and actually smelt that stuff. And my mining pickaxe has broken again. Okay, that's fine. So I did get one iron ore and one gold ore. So let's go back to the furnace and smelt that stuff. And now I'm going to find out if that craftsmanship is actually needed. Because craftsmanship, it says... It makes it easier to smelt ores. So maybe there's actually a chance that you fail smelting those ores. So maybe all of that was for absolutely nothing. Okay, climb that and please don't fall. Let me take a look. What do we have? We have a lot of stones and I mean a lot of them. And we have a gold ore and an iron ore. Fill mine card. Okay. Fill mine cards. Um, what do I, what do I get? Fill minecart with, with gold. Lost item gold ore. Okay, ready. Wait, did I get a gold bar now? No, I did not get a gold bar. Wait, maybe I have to go back down again because, I mean, I'm obviously throwing it, uh, you know, up there. And maybe it will come down right here as an iron bar. Can I walk on that? Oh, it seems like I'm fine. I thought maybe that's too hot and maybe I'm going to get damage here. But what happened What happened to my iron ore now? It didn't say anything about uh, failed or something like that. So at least the iron ore is, uh, the, the gold ore is gone. But what happened now? Let me try to figure that out. Do I have to fill the minecart until it's full? No iron ore or already added something. Maybe... I have to click something, I guess. Okay, I clicked ready. Do I have to push that into the into the furnace, maybe? Let me try. Can I, can I do that? Can I push that thing? It is filled. Can I push it? And now I think I'm stuck. Am I stuck here? <laughs> well, it's not that easy you get your ores. The question is just, what happened to my gold ore now? Is it gone? Time to find out. I think it's still here. Yes, uh, already added something. Yes, there is something in the mine uh, in the minecart, but how do I get my how do I get my my gold bar now? I probably shouldn't jump down there, but I will figure it out. You know what I just thought? It says 6 or so maybe I need six gold ores in order to get a gold bar. The problem is just I cannot add anything else. So I guess whenever I'm going to mine iron and silver now, I won't actually be able to put it in here because that gold bar is now blocking the, the mine card. What happens if I go out again? Let me see. Okay, the gold bar is probably still in there, so that means I will have to mine for a very long time, probably, until I get six of these ores. Hmm. Well, now that I know that, I will go back to the to the town, get some mining pickaxes, and continue to mine there. And obviously, I'm not going to show all that. Maybe if something interesting is going to happen, uh, obviously, we'll see each other right then. But now I will go back to all the towns, get a lot of mining pickaxes, and mine for a very long time. 
So the only problem is just, it seems like that guy, or not the guy, but the town, they don't have any more pickaxes. So I guess I'm out of luck now, because I, I guess I could check out Dürrhim really quick, but it seems like Ray Vadin, they don't have any more pickaxes. I guess these deserters should not attack me, hopefully, because I don't want to fight anyone now. I just want to see maybe the surrounding villages, maybe they have... Uh, no, wooden cross, poor iron. Well, at least they got some iron bars. I don't have an iron bar, but I guess I will check Dürrhim now. Maybe I could find a pickaxe there, but I guess only in the surrounding villages and ta or towns, maybe. Uh, arms merchant, can you guys see a pickaxe? Because I cannot see a, a pickaxe. Okay, guess I'm out of luck here. Yeah, maybe I will go back to the mine, but without any pickaxes, it's not that easy. <laughs> hmm, where else could be pickaxes? And what is what is close to the mine? Maybe Sargoth. Maybe Sargoth. Are we at war with them? Is that the Nordic? Yeah, that is the Nordic Union. I cannot go back there anymore because we're at war with them. Well, seems like I have to wait with the mines for quite some time because I don't have any more pickaxes. <laughs> well, well, well. Okay, never mind. My gold ore should be fine. I guess this is a good uh, opportunity to end the episode. I will not attend that tournament. I still need to capture an enemy lord from Rodox. I will try that. In the next episode, I will try to travel to Rodox territory. Maybe find some lord battles because... We have at least a few units who could be useful. I said who could be. These crossbowmen are actually somewhat uh, expensive. I'm not so sure if I should get any, if, if I should get any, get any of those. My God, I cannot even talk anymore. Okay, seems like I don't have a book. I honestly thought I bought a book at some point, but obviously I didn't. So, let me go to the tavern again and buy a book. Oh yeah, that book was too expensive, now I remember. I have 16,000 florins, ancient book of legends, 11,000 for a book. Okay, method, that sounds like engineer, that sounds like I have no idea. That sounds like I have no idea and that I have no idea as well. Well, I guess for the time being, I will not spend so much money on a book. Because I only have 16,000 florins and I don't really want to spend too much. Okay, so as I said, I think that's enough for this episode. I guess in the next episode, as I said, I will try to capture some Rodok Lords. But we could be in trouble. Because now that the Nordic Union uh, declared war on us as well, maybe they're going to attack one of our towns or castles somewhat soon. And even more abandoned mines. I really need an army. I really do. But as I said, for the time being, that's enough. Next episode, gather an army and defend our empire. Until then, farewell.